Hello, it's Marco Matos, Chief Markham 3D, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create landscapes very quickly, very simply using a built in add on. So, to enable the Ant Landscape add on, edit preferences, and we type in landscape, and we enable add mesh Ant Landscape. Close that. So, from here we go Shift A, mesh and landscape. Come over here into the bottom left hand corner, and now we've got a whole bunch of options that we can change. So, from here we can go to operator presets, and we can go, for instance, lakes. We can go cliff, or we can even come in and put in a canyon. And so here we've got a whole bunch of settings that we can change. So really you can just play around with it. We can make it on the X axis. Let's make it five. And now we've got a much bigger canyon that we can work with. And here it's broken up into a section. So we've got the noise section where we can change and distort things. So if I bump this up to 0.3, you can just see that everything's changing quite a bit. Um, we can come here to the display settings. So the height, we can change the maximum height to one and we'll leave it at minus 0.2 and let's bump that up to one now and we should have a very large up and down a little bit too extreme the fall off so it only falls off on the x-axis but we can just set it to none so it kind of continues on and then if we really wanted to we can add in a water plane as well so it gets all those uh, low spots and puts in kind of like a water texture. So this is the Ant Landscape add-on that comes with Blender. It's been with Blender for a very long time. Just need to enable it. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out, keeps you up to date with my content. And I really want to see what things that you come up with.